Most waivers, when they come into the barbershop, they go in and they ask to cut down to 1.5 every two weeks. Doing that will be detrimental to your wave journey. You won't be able to make progress because you're cutting your hair under its curl length too frequently. And if you didn't know, waves are laid down curl. So if your hair isn't long enough to curl, you cannot get waves. Now today, I'm gonna to show you how an elite waver gets his hair cut. I'm gonna show you if I'm gonna get a taper or not. I'm gonna show you how long I'm gonna cut down my hair, if I'm gonna go against the grain or with the grain. I'm just gonna show you all the intricacies and in how an elite waver cuts their hair because how an elite waver cuts their hair is different from how a beginner waver cuts their hair and even how an intermediate waver cuts their hair. Right, I saw my barber shop. See y'all when we get inside. Ah. I just left the barbershop. Now please beginners, what I'm gonna say is gonna sound like mumbo jumbo, but when you get to that intermediate stage, when you get better and better at waves and your knowledge expands, you're gonna know exactly what I'm talking about. So come back to this video in three months and then you're gonna be like, oh yeah, I did not actually understand what he's talking about, but now I get what he means because you'll be that much further in your wave journey. So when I went to the barbershop, I got a 2.5 with the grain, which means you're cutting with the grain. You know when you eat the steak, you cut it against the grain. The shake, you cut it against the grain, so it's easy, easier to slice. I'll go with the grain on my crown, because I want to keep my crown thick. And you could cut your crown against the grain, but my crown, I just want to develop it a little bit more. And I went against the grain on the top, as you guys saw. I got a three against the grain on the top and a four against the grain on the sides. I'm gonna go home and apply my products and watch this video right here to find out what you do after you get your haircut because getting the haircut isn't the last step. There's some stuff you gotta do after you get the haircut to maximize your results. Join the Discord server, link in the description. Uh, I think you got like 200 members now. Big community of waivers all helping each other. If your waves are looking good enough, if I see you're putting in the progress, you post, you post your waves in the Discord server, I'm gonna put it in a community post. Thanks for watching. God bless. Ah.